Earlier this year, I made a vow, a solemn swear, a promise that I would try to work through more of my back stock of old mystery boxes. So I was digging around and I found an older one. I found an older one. This one was purchased. You ready for this? May 6th, 2019. Three years old. You heard that right. Three year old mystery box. Craziness. So, this is called the Boom Loot Vaulted and Common Mystery Box. I think this is pretty much like towards the beginning of whenever Boom Loot started selling mystery boxes. I had to go back through my old like invoices on my account. It looks like they might have started maybe earlier in 2019. So this is maybe the first six months or maybe a year of them being like a mystery box seller. So this is this is an over a three year old mystery box. So pops in here. At the time of 2019, they could have been made in 2017. They were common pops. But three years later, those are pops now like five year old pops that are long vaulted. It might be valuable. So this is this could be kind of interesting. But it was six total pops, $11 per pop. So it wasn't like a crazy expensive mystery box. But the fun factor is, it is an over a three year old mystery box. What's going to be in this? Three years ago was a common pop. Now it could be a grail. Whenever I click on the actual web page to bring it up to see what it actually was, obviously that web page no longer exists because they took it down three years ago. You ready to do this? Let's see what I got. This should be interesting. Over three years old. Okay. Top of it. It's almost like you're you're like going through like an Egyptian pyramid, like trying to see what goodies are hiding, you know. So it looks like it's still pretty much the same setup three years ago as what it is now. So we got six bottles. Let's do the shake test. That one's really light. We'll do the super light one first. So this should be interesting. <laughs> this is over three years old. Over. First pop. What gems are hiding in a three-year-old mystery box? First one. What do we have? Vince Gilligan. This one came out. What, September 2018 it says. So when this got boxed up, it was like, what, six, eight months old? But now, it's been out over four years. You know what, while we do this video, I'm going to look up Pops as we go along, because I'm kind of curious to see like what might be vaulted, what not. I actually will look on, on the Funko app, because that will kind of show me what's vaulted and what's not vaulted. Vince Gilligan, he is vaulted. It's vaulted now. It's only worth 11 bucks though. Let me look at PPG. We'll look at the Funko app to see if it's vaulted or not. We'll look at PPG, the Hobby DB app, see what the actual value is. Funko app can be wrong on a lot of value sometimes. Hobby DB says 16 bucks PPG value. So first one 16. So we're up a little bit more than what I paid for the first pop. And first one came out to be vaulted now. So that's kind of fun. Here we go, pop number two. What treasures are in here? You ready? Which one's this? I'm uh, Oh! Wayne from Wayne's World! Has this pop for a long time? It was kind of funny. These are older pops now and they're all like extremely minty condition. This came out also September of 2018. This is over a four year old pop now. Like, see what's it's kind of crazy? These are four years old, but these, these have been boxed up for three years. So these are like pretty much like case fresh, perfect condition boxes. Wayne still says it's available on the Funko app. So you can still purchase this on the, uh, or the Funko can still order more of these, I should say. And PPG value is also 16 bucks. So first two, we came out ahead a little bit more than what I paid originally. So now we're at 32 bucks. We've almost made up close to, yeah. 
I think my, my, my brain's going too fast than what my, my uh, words can say. I just totally lost my train of thought right there. It was there and then it was gone. Anyway, here we go. Number three, what do we got? What is it? Oh, hey! Whoa, there's a, there is a fantastic one. Noise. That's a good hit. Doctor Strange Ghost Rider, LA Comic Con 2018, glow in the dark. The Hot Topic exclusive share sticker did not glow, only the con version glowed. And I hit the con version in this, nice. So when this thing first got boxed up, this thing was like what? A few months old? Let's see PPG value on this. Looking at 46 bucks now, very nice, good hit. 46 bucks and this box is freaking minty. Minty. That's what I'm talking about. That thing's been hidden in this box for over three years. Here we go. Pot number four. Are you ready? Come on, something big. Come on. What is it? Is that Black Panther? No, Eric Killmonger from Black Panther. Once again, everything's freaking minty. This came out in 2017. Eric Killmonger. Let's see what this was looking at. Let's do a Funko app first, see if it's vaulted or not on the Funko app. It is available. It is not vaulted still after five years. Only 10 bucks. It has a chase though. So right now we're looking at $88. So we've all, we were already in profit. In profit. Two pops to go still also. We're already in profit. Nice. There you go. Pop number, was it five? Is that the genie? Yep. Glow in the dark genie. Aladdin. This one came out. It says 2019, it must have been early 2019. Early 2019 pop right there. Glow in the dark Aladdin genie specialty series. Let's see the Funko app first. This pop is vaulted. It's vaulted now. And the PPG value of this it's only 13, really? Different variations, diamond collection. Yeah, 13 bucks, that's it. It's vaulted though. So it can do nothing but go up in value over time. Aladdin with, or a genie with lamp, glow in the dark, vaulted. Nice, we're now at 101 bucks. This box only cost me $66 over three years ago. We're doing okay, we're doing okay. Last box, come on, box number six. I feel good about this one. Are you ready? What is that thing? Naruto Shapudin Toby. His head looks like a pumpkin. Toby. This came out in 2017. Five years old. This has got to be vaulted, right? Hopefully it's valuable now because a lot of these Naruto Pops have some pretty good value to them. Fingers crossed. Come on. Big value. Actually, look at phone at first, see if it's vaulted or not. This pop says it's still available to purchase if they make more. PBG value of Toby, the pumpkin head Naruto Shippuden guy, coming in at 16 bucks. 16 bucks. This looks like grand total for this box, plus 16, $117. I bought this box for 66. Three years later, 117 so it was a little under a double up but hey i'm happy with that best hit was the was the glow uh dark strangers ghost rider worth like what 46 dollars so moral of the story is buy a mystery box that's full of common pops hold on to over three years and watch the value go up don't actually do that though but you could but i wouldn't recommend it anyway thanks for watching this was fun I have mystery boxes older than this one in storage still. I'm gonna dig them out as time goes on. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.